All right, I'm actually recording this time. What's up, guys? It's Burning Mania. Um, so I had already opened this box, but I haven't uh, I haven't opened any of the packs yet. Uh, so I got two blasters of optic because there's no chronicles anywhere. We've looked for like I don't know if it's been a week, but we've been looking in all these places and they're just nowhere to be found. And this was the only UFC box that they actually had was an optic. And uh, I don't usually get this kind, but it looks like you can get gold vinyls. So, that's cool. That's the only reason I opened so much select, was trying to hit a 101. It didn't end up happening though. But I did hit multiple golds, so that was cool. That was the first times I've ever hit any golds. Put the garbage down there. Let's see what we got. I don't usually buy this product, so we got Kevin Lee. Ketlin Vieira, Peter Yan, Amanda Nunez, and a Frank Mir Silver. Now, if someone could tell me why Peter Yan's cards are so expensive for no reason, even if he was robbed, he's still, I think, on like a three or four fight losing streak. All started with his uh, purposeful illegal knee. We got Drikas Duplessis. Paulo Costa, Brandon Moreno, Mr. Conor McGregor, hey, Al Jermaine Sterling. Is this not numbered? Is purple not numbered in these? Huh. I thought for sure that was going to be numbered. I don't know. I, like I said, I don't usually open this. I don't know what the... Uh, I do not know what kind of card this is or what kind of cards are in here besides the gold vinyls <laughs> oh. but uh, yes because the chronicles are so loaded this year I'm trying to find them and they're they're just gone everyone's been buying them up we had Umar and Islam back to back men in fear Taylor Santos and a Silver Sean O'Malley. Which I'm not going to sleeve because I'm not a fan. Have I not hit a single rookie yet? Is this the one where they they only have like a couple rookies in the box? I think I opened some of this last year, but it wasn't a ton, so I'm like very new to this set. Uh, but uh, we gotta give it a try. Tisha Torres. Yeah, this, I think these are, they have the rated rookies, right? Oh, yeah, there's one. Hey, that's a good one, too. And we got a Dominators, which I don't care about. But we got a Raul Rosa's rated rookie. If I could sleeve it. There we go. Yeah, he just uh, had a nice, what was it, like a first round knockout win? Coming back off his loss when all his prices were down. Now they're all sky high again. Something's in this pack. It's probably an insert. I don't know, but it's a different color than what I've been seeing. So, see what it is. We got Khabib, Rosnama Nunez, Magomed Ankalaev, Kamara Usman, Tai Tuivasa Rising Suns. That's what I saw. This must be just the base variant. Not really a fan of weird random inserts like that. I think there's also one called like Stairmasters or something. Which, so I understand that it's a, a like them staring in the background. <laughs> But the first one I ever saw was of Derek Lewis, a Stairmasters of Derek Lewis. I, it might have been from last year's set. And I thought it was hilarious because you know Derek Lewis isn't using any Stairmaster thing. <clears throat> Alright, we got Chael Sonnen. Something's bent in this pig. We got Daniel Cormier. Oh, it's an auto. We got Raquel Pennington and then a Peter Yan lighted up. 
Yeah, I was gonna say I felt something bending, which usually means there's either an auto or another another uh, types of cards. There could be a uh, like a foil in the pack. Oh, there's something in my sleeve. Look at all that stuff in my sleeve. What is that? Well, that's cool. We got an auto in the first box. Are these juice too, just like Chronicles? Alright, I'm gonna use a different sleeve. I can't get whatever that is out. Oh, there's something in this sleeve too. Ridiculous. Alright, well. That's cool. Base auto, Raquel Pennington. I do not recall what her, uh... I guess it's a cool looking card, just the base version, I guess. That was pack number one. Let's move on to box number two. Garbage to the side over here. Missed a pack. So, I was really hoping to find those Chronicle Blaster boxes, but, oh, that's another thing. I know I haven't uploaded a video in a while, but. Not much to upload at the moment, I'm just working a bunch. And uh, I'm still waiting on my, one of my PSA returns. I sent it out like around the same time as the, uh, the tops one that I got back recently. But the second one I sent out was a dual grading one. So you know, I knew it was gonna take longer, but I didn't think it was gonna take this long. I got Curtis Blades, Charles Oliveira, Henry Cejudo, and a Montel Jackson rated rookie. Another non numbered purple. I guess the rookie cards are uh, less common in optic than they are in, in the other uh, sets. Was there like one per box or something? Looks like there's another purple here. We got uh, Alexa Grasso. Jared Cannon. Whoa, Jared takes up like this whole card. It's kind of a weird angle. His arm is huge. It looks like it's bigger than the rest of his body. It's a weird picture. Sean Strickland. Stevenson Figueredo. We got a Henry Cejudo out of 59. Number one out of 59. That's interesting. No clue what this is called. It couldn't have been a numbered hot prospect for me to flip real quick. It had to be Henry. I think Henry is, I don't know if it's like official, but they've been talking about him fighting Marab. Pretty sure that's uh, what they got in the works going on. Patty Pimblet fighting Saturday. Jalen Turner. Josh Barnett. Ooh, something numbered again. Oh, wow, we got a red. <laughs> it's Raquel Pennington again. <laughs> All right, we got a Patty Pimblet. <laughs> There's no way I just pulled two Raquel Pennington autos. What is that? This one's numbered. That's a cat here. This one's numbered at a 199. Really though? Raquel Penny? Where's the other one? Look. Anybody like Raquel Pennington? I got a part of the rainbow right here. I can't remember if she's on a win streak or not. I have no idea. I have to look that up, but that's crazy two blasters two autos the same auto 
man, if it was someone like actually cool, like Shavkat or something, that would have been crazy. George St. Pierre, Juliana Pena. Oh, that's a good one. That's a hollow uh, or a silver. <laughs> what is that? All right, it's a silver Aaron Blanchfield rated rookie. It couldn't have been her auto twice. That would have been way better. That's still a nice card. This box is uh, already doing better than the first one. Especially when you get a numbered version of the same auto. <laughs> All of the base cards just fell over. Oh my gosh. Alright, we got Mobzai, Stephen Thompson, Benil Darius, Ooh, another Raider rookie, and a BJ Penn Dominators base version. Not really interested in that. <sighs> There's like weird stuff all over my cards. Oh, we got another Raider rookie here, Patrick Sabatini. We're on the last pack. Yeah, I don't know if I'll be opening this uh, anymore. I just kind of was bored and wanted to do it. So, this pack feeling kind of small. So I don't think anything good's in this pack, but we'll find out. All right, we got Surreal Gun. We got Gilbert Burns. Yair Rodriguez. Patty Pimblet again on the Light It Up. This one looks kind of a different color. Where's the other one? I literally just pulled one of these. It's like the same Patty Pimble. <laughs> Look, that is a different color. What? So one of them, that's so weird. And neither one of them is numbered. They're just both. So this must be like the base one. And then this one's like some kind of bluish one. I don't know. I guess I'll sleeve this one up. You guys think Patty's going to win Saturday? Think he's going to lose to Tony? Say Prism on the back of all these cards? I'm confused. So this Patty right here. Unless Prism's like a variant in this. All right, so the back of this one at the bottom says Prism. Is that what this is called, the Prism version? And then this one says nothing on the back. Where's the other one? What's the other one say on the back? Nothing, yeah. All right, so I guess it's called the Prism version. I don't know. Well, there we go. We got two patties. Peter Yan. Not really interested in those. We got uh, Patrick Sabatini. Whatever that's called. We got a silver Aaron Blanchfield rated rookie. We got the two Raquel Penningtons at a 199 in base, if anyone's interested. And then we got a number at a 59 Henry Cejudo. Could have been crazy. Could have been a bow nickel rookie or something. We got Montel Jackson, purple non numbered rated rookie. Tai Tui Vasa on the Rising Suns. Another good rookie, Raul Rosas. We got the silver, Sean O'Malley. Oh, and we got the silver, Frank Mir. And then we got Aljamain Sterling Purple. Yeah, overall, I don't really enjoy uh, these cards as much. I can't wait for tops to come out, though. I will be opening tops. I love tops. Still making my full top set but uh if i ever find any more cards for it i'll make an update video but i think right now i have like 53 out of 100 or something but i hope you guys enjoyed and i'll see you next time